Hi everyone and welcome to this vlog. Yeah, we're going to combine three different cruises that we did into the one vlog today and we'll be traveling almost five miles in an easterly direction, uh, leaving Coisley behind and traveling through Marbury and on to Rembury. And first we'll show you a little bit of drone footage at Coisley, showing the surrounding area and then some photos of uh, our trip. I hope you enjoy those as well as the rest of the vlog. So let's get on with it, should we? She's Ali. He's Pete. This, this is Vega. And this is Narrowboat Soulmates. More to explore. So here we are about to leave Coisley Visitor Moorings and we're going to proceed about three quarters of a mile further up to Marbury Visitor Moorings. Only going under one bridge this morning. Nice short trip but we just want to more closer to where our car is and we can do some walks and go and explore Big Mere and Little Mere while we're there. Yeah, it's a great property. Look at that farm. Beautiful up there on the hillside. Overlooking this beautiful view.
here we are coming up to our first bridge of the day and it's going to be the last one I reckon too and it's quite a high one probably didn't even need to take me from cover down Yeah, so we just moored up here, just past bridge 24. In between a gap in the trees, but the sun's pretty high anyway. This time of the year, isn't it? June. Usually it's up pretty early. So yeah, you get a good dose of solar, as long as it's not overcast. So we're well, just taking the buddy for a quick... Check the calves there. Thank you. And here's some photos of the lovely walk we had round Marbury and the Mears. Here we are about to leave Marbury Visitor Moorings. We've had a great couple of days here. It's a fantastic spot with a village only about half a mile away and a really lovely place to go and visit. And we're going to head two mile downstream and, and probably stop at Renbury Frith just before the lift bridge. So I think all we've got to do today is one look. And it's going to be a scorcher of a day. It's currently 25 and we're getting to 29 today. So we're probably going to look for a mooring under a shady tree for a change. Yes, the shade is more important than the solar for the next couple of days. On the boat, see? Hey, Zing. Good boy. Morning. Hi. Morning. Gorgeous. Yeah. <laughs> it's gorgeous day. Beautiful. Yeah. And tomorrow's to the same. Yeah, take as much of this Guess as we can get. Love it. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Definitely beer drinking weather. <laughs> well, I thought really probably the cap's not gonna be doing me too much good. So I thought put the old proper hat on, the old straw boater is it yeah so we can cover a bit of the back of me now i've got the fact of 50 is it maybe maybe i've even gone down to 30 for today but anyway let's get on with it That's the beautiful village of Marbury there. We went round that yesterday. And a good look round the church and the mere. There's a couple of mares here, large mare and little mare. Got a look at those. Beautiful. Hi, the lock will be set for you. Yeah, okay. Thank you. 
Well, that's Ali safely off while we tootle up to the lock, the one and only lock today. Somebody coming up it from the look of it. So we just have to hang back and we'll be able to go straight in, hopefully. Yes, well, that family was their first time out on a boat. So, yeah, in Rembury, it was a bit tight because there's lots of boats there. Here he comes, yes, oh yes, he's on the boat, he's making sure he doesn't get left behind, don't you Zig, eh? Yeah? Yeah, so Marbury Lock and there's uh, sort a of lovely canal side property. Yeah. Some beating down. Nelly doing the business at the front, getting the lock sorted out. She said she's going to need a haircut soon because there's that much of it, especially when it's 26 degrees. She feels like she's got one of those busbies that. Is it a busby? And the soldiers were. Well, oh, Ali's done a heavy lifting for the day. Now she can relax on the bow. And take some photos. How good is that on such a gorgeous day? Yes, and the farmer's already getting some sort of crop grass cut. Been so scorching apart from a few rainy days. This is that bird song. Wow, it's so loud, all the different birds. Amazing. We're just making our way down the Langothan Canal before we decide what we're going to do. Are we going to turn left and go to that beautiful city? Yes, Chester. That's a Cestrian, I think I'd vote for that. Maybe even some pubs open, so definitely go for that. We can visit one or two of our favourites in Chester. We had a go fishing the last couple of days and 
one proper session for an hour or so and as you can see I've got the maggots and they're all turning to casters but yeah I managed to catch a couple of fish a little roach and a, another roach which was a bit bigger that was good bit of nice relaxation Yeah, and this particular farmer, quite enterprising, he's uh, got a horse run on the outside of his crops. And he got some little jumps there all the way around. All, I don't know, it's like probably at least 800 metres, massive field. But yeah, so somebody likes their horses and a little bit of jumping. Well, there's our second bridge of the day, of course, because we had one right next to the first lock bridge 22 I reckon looks a bit narrow obviously with the vegetation growing sticking out makes it look even more narrow I am extremely envious <laughs> it's going to be a beautiful day oh magnificent oh. I want to play that game it's a very quiet engine you've got there. Yeah. Hey, uh, Hi. You're doing a right nice shady spot you got there. Oh, I know. <laughs> Any kingfishers? No, Any kingfishers? No, 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 no. Well, we've had a bit of a decision. Ziggy had the casting vote, and he said he'd rather have cooler than solar. Is that right, Zig? You'd rather have cooler than solar, yeah? So we're going to move down about 100 metres there. We find this boat that's coming from under the left bridge. Comes past us. If they decide to moor up there, well, we're going to stay here, probably. So, well voted, Zeke. Vote with your feet. Well, we're going to move a bit where we'd like to debate if solar or cooler. Yeah, I'd rather have solar. So we took refuge in the shade and there's some of our photos from our walk round Remby Frith. Here we are leaving Renbury Frith and we're going to go just over two miles uh, east north easterly direction and stop the other side of Renbury at Renbury Heath and I think we've got three lift bridges to go through today. One of them's electric where we're going to potentially stop road traffic. The other two should just be little farmers ones. Anyway, uh, the sun's out again after pouring with rain earlier. And I think we've got a couple of hours before the next storm, so let's get going. And 100 metres to go to the lift bridge. This one's a hand cranked one. And I think the next one, Ali will be able to put the key in and press the button. Of course, I'll have to release the key off my keys here. She hasn't thought to the head on that one. We'll soon get that sorted because, of course, it stops the traffic. You don't want to do that too long, otherwise you get those shouts of abuse sometimes. 
Not that we've ever had any of that. We let the other boat come through. He was a single handed boater. We're just going through now. My waiting over there for the bridge to go down. It wasn't that. Oh, a couple that way as well. That's a lot. There we go. Past the higher boats. Hello. And thank you for your assistance. Yeah, another couple of the higher boats here. Waiting, yeah. ABC boating. So, you go online if you want to have a go at this. I'm sure, they'd be happy to hire a boat to you. You can get out and about on the Langothan. That's definitely well worth doing. Now we're off to undo this next lift bridge, wind it up.
Yeah, some beautiful clouds up there. Look at that. Nice and white and fluffy. Now we're going up to bridge 17. Signal's good here. Hey? The signals are right here. Yeah. What about here? Yeah. And it's wide. Hey? And it's wide. Here's some of our photos from our trip from one side of Rembury to the other. Hope you've enjoyed this vlog. If you did, click the like button. If you'd like to subscribe, we'd love you to click the subscribe button. And if you'd like to know when the next one's coming out, click the bell. Thanks for watching. And on our next vlog, we'll be spending our last few nights on the Langoflin Canal before we head back onto the Shroppy proper. Stay safe out there, everybody. Bye for now.